hi guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are going to learn how to make a simple youtube intro like this on your phone the apps we are going to use for this tutorial are video leap and the eraser app but before we proceed kindly make sure you've watched these two videos on my channel i'll link them in the description box below um, because you're going to use them for this tutorial so first of all you search for a background that you want to use for your intro any color of your choice but i'm going for a marble background so i just saved that off the internet then we go into video leap and export the background to video leap but then make sure you change the format to the youtube format make sure that is done and go to the fill option beneath there so that it would fill the entire space now click on mixer to export your cartoon logo which we made from the previous video then we want to do away with the white background of the logo so we click on blend and we could either do with the multiply option or the darken option but i'm going to do with the multiply option so i just click on the multiply and it does away with the white background so now we have no white background it blends in perfectly perfectly moving on we are going to add text to the logo so you just choose the text option down there and type in what your youtube channel is about so if it's beauty lifestyle fashion um travel food just type that in there and yeah that's just the position it's just beneath the the logo and resize it because after typing if it's that long obviously it will be out of frame so you just resize it and then i changed the color as well so i changed it to black and then i changed the font so all of those options are down there so you just play around with it to suit your preference so i'm just resizing it and then i went ahead to change my font so there are a lot of fonts to choose from you choose your desired font and there we have it so this is like the first phase now we don't want the beginning of our intro to be too boring so we're going to add a little twist to it just go to the animation option go to in and then select any of the animations of your choice i'm choosing the flicker option and i'm also adjusting the speed so i'm doing that for the logo and so yeah that is my desired animation so i'm choosing that and then so it flicks whilst coming in and i do the same for the text so with the text i'm choosing the um, typewriter option there are lots to choose from actually but that is what i'm going for so it makes it type so that's what i'm choosing for my animation and also i adjusted the speed as well so there you have it now that that is done we open the eraser app and import any picture of your choice what we are going to do is we are going to erase the background so you choose the erase option down there and choose um target area and just tap on the background it would literally do away with uh, like every background color so that's what we're doing and once you are done with that you save to your gallery now we go back into the video leap app and select the mixer option to import the picture that we just saved from the eraser app but kindly note that i'm using the paid version of this app which allows me to do more than one mixer per project if you are not using the paid option it allows you to do one mixer per project so you might as well want to save after every mixer and open it again to continue now i go to the sticker option to search for instagram facebook and twitter logos so you just go to the sticker option down there and search for all of these logos they are all there so you just find them they come in very handy so you select them and position them wherever you want them to be After that is done you go to the text option to add your social media handles so you just go to text and type it in change your color change your font if you wish to so, uh, select your desired fonts and color and just position them there nicely now to the last phase of our intro 
we go to the mixer option again to import the animated youtube subscribe button that we made from our previous one of our previous videos so you just click on mixer and you import that video so there you have it and everything is there nice je, 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 je. and yeah obviously i need to extend the background so you just extend it to where the video ends and that is it so now let's just play from the beginning to see how it has all come together like how everything is looking so there you have it okay okay the last thing to do now is to add some background music so you just choose the audio option down there select music and choose any of your choice all of these music are actually copyright free so we are permitted to use it on youtube so you just select any one of your choice download and it would automatically be added to your intro now we have our background music added and it's looking perfect already um, one more thing to do is to trim the music to where the video actually ends so i'm just going to cut that part off and then delete that part but what i'm going to do next is to fade the music so we are fading it out at the end so you just adjust the timer as in where you want the fade to start so pay your discretion now that it's all done all you need to do is to save it to your gallery so just click on save and it will be exported to your gallery and now let's go ahead to see how our intro is looking thanks so much for watching this video guys i hope this tutorial will guide you to make your own simple youtube intro like we just did and don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video with your friends i'll see you in my next video bye